ईशान अंश शिवांश अद्विक कनिष्का गुड मॉर्निंग वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग टू ऑल ऑफ यू यस माइलिंग यस यू शुड स्माइल बिकॉज योर होल डे विल बी गुड nice if you will smile now your whole day will be very nice so now you think what you have to do either you have to smile either you have to be sad yes very nice kanishka done with the lady finger wow good good others have you done your homework how many of them have done their homework please show me yes good good very nice both of you have done nicely others what about you ishan vedan shridam ovi have you done your homework yes very nice nishis very good good with the yellow color wow good keep it up okay till others join shall we pray so come on join your hands close your eyes and start your prayer yes very good anch come on say guru re brahma guru re vishnu guru re devo maheshwara guru re sakshat para brahma tasmay shri guru ve namaha Yes. So come on, rub your hands and put down your eyes and slowly, slowly open your eyes. Very good. Okay. So children, before starting today, we are going to see one rhyme, and that rhyme is on our teeth. Yes. So come on. Let's see. What is the rhyme? Okay, so come on, open your rhyme and story book. Yes, and the rhyme is my tooth brush. What is the rhyme? My tooth brush. So all of you brush. Yes, yes. When when you brush in the morning and in night. Yes. Can you all show me your brush? Yes. Do you have a brush? Can you all show me? bring it and show me come on let me see yes very good you know where is your brush good good thing very good thing yes that is your brush very nice kanishka is going and searching here or under yes advik has a green color brush Kanishka has a pink color brush. Okay. Shri Ram has a yellow color brush. Yes. Anch. Anch Why? also yellow color. Shri Ram has purple color brush. Wow. And yes, Ishan. Anything? Okay. Nishis has a blue color brush, and Obi also has a pink color brush. Okay. Good. Good. so this is called as toothbrush why it is called as toothbrush because we use that brush to what to brush our teeth yes so we use it to brush so it is called as toothbrush yes this is our tooth this teeth are called as if you take on one tooth it is one tooth and that is your brush so it is called as toothbrush okay so now that brush on that brush there is one rhyme so the first line of the rhyme is i have a toothbrush neat and clean come on take your toothbrush and say i have a toothbrush neat and clean yes to brush my teeth with every day yes you brush it every day Yes, good. So come on, say. I have a toothbrush, neat and clean, to brush my teeth every day. Yes, you brush it with every day. Yes. So come on, say. I have a toothbrush, neat and clean, to brush my teeth with every day. 
Now, when do you brush your teeth? I brush them each morning. I brush them each night. Yes, I have told you to brush in the morning. Yes, when you get up, you have to brush. And before going to bed, you have to also brush your teeth. Yes, so what they are telling? I brush them each morning. I brush them each night. Why? Why we are going to brush? Until what time we are going to brush it? Till they are shining, clean and bright. जो परंतु तेरे स्वच्छ होते नहीं तो परंतु तुम्हें ब्रश करना है ना? Yes. So I brush them each morning. I brush them each night. Till they are shining, clean and bright. Yes. Till they all are clean, all the cavities are running. Yes. Till that time you are going to brush it. So come on. The whole rhyme we will see again. Yes. I have a toothbrush neat and clean. I have a toothbrush neat and clean to brush my teeth with every day. To brush my teeth with every day. I brush them each morning. I brush them each night. Yes, I brush them each morning. I brush them each night till they are shining clean and bright. Till they are shining clean and bright. Yes. So every body will brush their teeth for two times in the morning and before going to the bed. Okay. So this was a rhyme on a toothbrush. And can you see this girl? She is brushing. Yes. Like this, you should brush to the upper teeth, down teeth, to the tongue, to the sides. Everywhere you should brush properly. Yes, my children will do it. I know. Okay. So this was the rhyme. Now, students, yesterday we have seen some animals home. Yes, animals scooter hatan apan kal bagid lai. So now in that home there are also some babies. Yes, animal also have some small small babies. So they have different different names for that baby. The not different different names. That's a apna kaise mummy papa ni naout thay bolay. That's a the babies la pan kai tari matad, isn't it? So now we are going to see what are the names of that babies. Okay. So everybody has to open their general awareness primer book. This is the book general awareness primer book, and the page number is. Six, six, sixty-six. Yes, Sacha, I have seen. Wonderful. Yes, everyone has done the homework. Good, good. Yes. So it's page number sixty-six. Come on, open the page. Did you find it? Yes. Now we are going to see the small, small babies of the animals and. Most of these babies you have seen, yes, here and there you have seen. So let's see what is called what. Okay, so the topic name is animals, babies. Yes, animals, babies. So come on, look, point, and learn. So you have to learn the names of the babies. Okay, yes. So the first one. So the first one is a. Dog, yes, and his baby is called as puppy. What it is called as puppy? Yes, if they are many, if it is one, we will call it as puppy. And if there are many small small dogs, we will call we will call it as puppies. Yes, there are many puppies. We can call it yes. So this is a dog, and his young one, his baby, is called as. Puppy, yes. Okay. Now the next one. What is it? It is a hen, and her younger one, her baby, is called as kitten. What it is called as? Oh, sorry, cheeks, cheeks. I'm sorry. It is called as cheeks, and they are of which color? They are of. Yellow color and they are very small. They are also like the hen, and they also walk on the two legs. So the next one is 
hen and the cheeks hen and the cheeks okay the third one it is a duck yes duck. it is a duck and her babies are called as ducklings and there is also a nice story of duck and duckling some day i will tell you the story of duck and ducklings so the small babies can you see the small one yes yellow color small babies yes so they are called as duckling and they go behind their mamma isn't it the mamma is going and they always go behind their mamma okay yes the next one this animal is called as tiger yes and his small baby can you see the baby here the small one is called as cub is called as cub yes the small baby is called as cub so the tiger and cub okay this you can see everywhere this is a cat and her younger one the small baby is called as kitten and it is very small when it is born they cannot see this kitten when it is very small they didn't open their eyes for 7 to 8 days yes and after that they slowly slowly start walking they are very thin if you have seen the baby kittens they are very small very small so the cat and the kitten cat and the kitten okay now the next one from where we get the cotton that is sheep sheep and her small one can you see the small one it's called as lamb yes it is called as lamb there is also one rhyme mary has a little lamb little lamb little lamb we are going to see that right but always remember the sheep and the lamb okay so come on let's revise all this and then move to the next page come on first is the dog and puppy come on see dog and puppy hen and chick hen and chick duck and duckling duck and duckling tiger cub tiger and cub cat and kitten cat and kitten sheep and lamb sheep and lamb okay so this is the first page now turn your page and you can see some more yes okay so this is the animal from which we get the milk is called as cow and her baby is called as calf cow and calf cow and calf cow and calf very good now this is which animal it is a frog it is a frog which always do dara dara yes and i always say crazy frog crazy frog so this is a frog and his small baby is called as tadpole what it is called as tadpole very good so frog and tadpole frog and tadpole okay so the next one this is a deer deer and his baby is called as fawn his baby is called as fawn so deer and fawn deer and fawn yes okay now this one which hops it is called as kangaroo and his small baby is called as jo jo yes kangaroo and jo kangaroo and jo okay now who is she it is a goat it is a goat and 
her small baby is called as kid what is it is called as kid yes so goat and kid goat and kid yes now the next one yes we can have a ride on it and it is called as horse it is called as horse and the small horse is called as fowl yes the small horse is called as fowl okay so come on let's revise all this cow and calf cow and calf come on say cow and calf frog and tadpole frog and tadpole deer and fawn deer and fawn okay next one kangaroo and joy kangaroo and joy goat kid goat and kid horse and fall horse and fall yes so these are the names some of them you know cat kitten and all everything you know but some are new like frog or horse deer so you have to remember this names yes so come on turn the page let's see what is here okay now on the next page yes on the next page you can see send the animal to their correct home correct home manje kal apan animals se bagitle yes homes kutle kutle so can you see down here there are some animals yes so what you have to you have to take this animal to their home tanna tancha gharat jaun tumhala kay karayche sodayche so where does first is the lion so where will the lion go where does he stay yes come on in a in a den so where is the den come on take him to the den come on draw a line from a lion to den okay i will show you by doing the back camera how will you will take you will start drawing line from the lion to the den okay now next who will tell me yes so the next one will tell by shivanch shivanch what is this sparrow and where is their home where does the sparrow stays at home yes what is that called dear it is called as nest nest so come on take the sparrow to the nest yes very good okay next is shri ram what is this shri ram honey bee yes honey bee and where is his home kuthe and what is the name here yes here what it is called Kaya what it is kya called hello come on go back and see what it is called here can you see what it is called go back and see go back and see come on come on yes hi very good okay the next one is adwik adwik what is this and 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 where does ant stays and ant cha house la kay mhanta ha yes this one and ant cha house la kay mhanta Huh. Yes, I have given you one tip also to remember it. It is called as an hill. Yes, it is like a hill going up. So it is called as an hill. Go back and see. Advik, is it called as an hill? Come on. Yes. Okay. Good. Good. Okay. So now, children, come to the next page. 
Cure. Help the babies to find their mother. Can you see here are the mothers? And here are the babies. Okay. So come on. Let's help the babies. Okay. The first one is Shoy. So let's take Joy to his mother. Come on. How you will find a way? Yes. From here will he go? Like this. Yes. And we can find the way. Very good. Next is Tadpole. And where is his mother? Frog and Tadpole. So come on, take him. Yes, can you find the way? Yes, I can find it. And fall and horse. So come on, take fall. Good, good. Very good. So all the babies are with their mother now. Very good. Do it slowly. No problem. Very good. Yes. Done. Okay. Good, good. Yes, yes. Take your own time. No problem. Okay. So, we will discuss what is your homework. Yes. Come on. So, for that, you have to open General Awareness Practice Book. Yes. General Awareness Practice Book. And the page number of it is 3, 4, 34. What is the page number? 3, 4, 34. Come on, find for the page. Yes, animal babies. Okay, so this is the page. So what you have to do, listen. From the sticker sheet, paste pictures of animals baby next to their mother. Okay. So for that, you have to go back to the sticker sheet and down here. Can you see? Here, yes. So you have to take one from that. So first, I'm sorry. Okay. So first, if I have, I will give you one example. So first is cow. So I will take the cow's baby is called as who will tell me cow's baby is called as come on children cow yes so come on take the cow and paste in front of cow like this yes are you getting cow cow yes so like this down also tiger Cup. So you will do this as a homework. If you can do now, no problem. In two minutes, it will be over also. Yes, half of the people have started pasting it. Okay, so no problem, you can paste. Very good, very good. Yes, take the sticker carefully and then paste it properly. So tiger and cup. Yes, sheep and lamb and kangaroo and joe. Done. Wow, good. Done. Yes. Very good, very good. So done with your homework now only? Okay, no problem. I will give you a different one, don't worry. You will have some homework. Okay, so first we will do one phonics sound. 
and then i will give you some homework and it will be your favorite homework because it will be a coloring homework today okay yes so first we will do one phonics sound so open your phonics book this is your phonics book and the page number is 3232 come on take out 3232 good good now today we are going to see the sound of this letter that is x so what is the sound of x x x yes x x yes so don't say a k and s Yes. What is the sound? Yes. Have you seen a cooker? Yes. Have you seen the cooker? How is the whistle of the cooker? Yes. Don't say s. It's s. Yes. K and S together. K and S together. That is s. So this is the sound of X. So listen and sing. Hear, hear. Can you hear? Letter X says X, X, X. Yes, this is the sound. Beginning with X, you can say X-ray. So can you see the sound X-ray? Yes, X-ray. And the next one is gramophone. Yes. so these are the two words that come from the sound okay now can you see it is a xmas tree here so an xmas tree decorated by you and me yes so this is a xmas tree yes now down here look and name and write the correct letter so the first one is what it is a fox Yes, so can you get a sound of x at end? Box, fox. Yes, in the last sound, why they have given you the underline and no empty space is given because you have to write the letter x. Yes, so first one is fox. Yes, so ending sound is. So you will write x. Come on, write the. Next one is box. So the ending sound is box. Yes, right. Come on. X. Yes, and the last one is six. Yes, the ending sound is six. Yes, so right. Come on. Box, fox, six. Yes, mix. the sound is coming up so we are writing x yes so take the consonant which consonant we have done today come on tick on the head of it yes good good so when you will practice this sound then only you will get yes what is the sound yes good good everyone can do it okay so very good box box 6 very good advik has written yes you have also written very good very good everyone has written box box 6 okay so yes what happened any problem shagun okay so children now what is your homework so your homework is from drawing and coloring book you have to color this boat yes so at the sea so you have to boat this you have to color first you have to track this and then you have to color this boat so this is your homework so do it as a homework so today a coloring homework so you will be very relaxed today okay
yes and revise all the rhymes all the sounds because your oral is going to happen in the next month so you have no yes dear can we yes the homework is yes send it again no problem page number 21 2121 this is your homework okay yes got it kanishka okay so do it color it nicely they have told you to first track so gandhi pehle track kar raha hai and then you have to color okay so do it children so have a good day we will stop here only Bye bye. Have Thank a good day. Stay blessed. Hi everyone. Bye. Good day. Bye. Have a good day. Yes, very good. Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye, Ganeshka.